And a historic night here in Cardiff is underway. The first bell rings for Cage Warriors 100. And has it opening up with some good kicks early. He snatched this front headlock position. He's really looking to get some torque on it. Got a good grip around the neck there, and Corson almost dropping oh, to the mat. Up to submission! Wow! Brett Hassett avenges the quick submission loss okay. with a quick submission win here at Cage Warriors 100. That was a phenomenal guillotine. I mean, he, he snatched it from the standing position, turned his man all the way around, and the, the pressure he had when he put him down to the mat was phenomenal. Be interesting to get a quick look back at the finish of that one. Brett Hassett cinching up that guillotine up against the cage. And really not giving Michael Corson any room to breathe there. Yeah, I mean, he, he counted the shot and he snatched it. And it's, it's a, you see that high wrist position. Look, he switches the grip, drives the hand up. And that, that wrist position really does make it incredibly tight. That's a, it's a flawless guillotine snatched from the standing position. It really is. The veteran competitor, Brett Hassett, was able to keep his calm this time. There's the submission as we see it again. What a perfect angle he gets on the neck. Pushes the wrist up with the right hand. Forced and forced to drop his legs out from underneath him, but it really was a last-ditch attempt. There was no room to breathe. Forced and forced to tap, and Brett Hassett picks up his first Cage Warriors victory here as a professional. A man from Bridgewater, England, very happy with that one as he celebrates here in the Viola Arena. Let's throw this one to our MC in the cage, Mr. Andy Freelander, to make it official. Five hands, referee Rich Mitchell calls a stop to this contest at exactly 21 seconds of the very first round, declaring the winner by submission via guillotine choke, Brett the Werewolf Hassett. A big win for Brett Hassett. To open the card here in Cardiff, he joins my broadcast colleague Josh Palmer in the cage. I'm here with our winner, Brett Hassett. Brett, last time out at Cage Warriors, you suffered a quick submission loss. This time, that's got to be one of the fastest submissions we've ever seen. Well, I wouldn't say I can't do jiu-jitsu, but I must put this motherfucker asleep in 20 seconds. I can do jiu-jitsu. Sorry about language there, folks. Um, Let's just talk about that finish, because what people may not have seen from behind is you got a high wrist all the way through and you pushed it through with the other hand. A really technical finish. Is that something you've been working on specifically in the gym? Yeah, my uh, jiu-jitsu coach, Jordan Kirk, has been showing me his variations. And I've been landing in the gym non-stop, so thank you, Jordan. This is your, your fourth professional win, and they've all come in the first round. Uh, you know, it, it, you, you made, a, made a, a fast start on this one. Is that just something you're going to look to continue? Yeah, I'd rather go and get knocked down in two minutes than do a boring 50 minute fight. I'm coming here to die or kill him. One last thing and then I'll let you go. How does it feel to have opened up? What is a momentous Cage Warriors 100 card here? Mate, I'm just having a minute bit here now. I'm just going to go out with the boys and my missus or coach. We're going to get drunk and we're going to be back in March and be wherever they want me to be up. Look forward to seeing it then. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Brett Hassett.